I'm Storm Tracker AT Meteorologist Austin Haskins with your Halloween weather forecast. It has been a messy morning across the Chippewa Valley. The first accumulating snow of the season has caused for slick road conditions, even a few spin outs and accidents reported. So if you are traveling this morning, please slow down and use caution on those roadways. Also the bridges and overpasses, things like that. Because we could be dealing with not only the snow covered and slick conditions with the, uh, from the snow, but also some black ice as well with temperatures below freezing in those roadways on the wet side. The good news is though, as we head towards late morning, the snow will begin to taper off and we should actually see some sunshine by the afternoon hours. And we are gonna be quiet into trick or treating time tonight, but just keep in mind, it's still gonna be a little breezy and a little chilly. So if you're taking the kids out trick or treating or you're going out yourself for any outdoor uh, activities or things like that, definitely wanna dress a little bit on the warmer side. It'll be cold tonight, increasing clouds tomorrow, but we'll be dry tomorrow at least. And then the clouds will move out heading into Wednesday night. And then the clouds will kind of filter back in for Thursday morning. But Thursday itself will be a little bit on the sunnier side than what we'll see for Wednesday. So additional snowfall through about noon today, about a trace to an inch. There could be a few isolated spots that see about one to two inches. A couple of snow reports have come in so far, so be sure to check our social media pages for the updates on that. Most spots will likely see about one to two, maybe up to three inches of snow when it's all said and done. So for today, we'll see a high of 39 in Eau Claire, but you can see the wind chill staying in the uh, 20s to maybe near 30 uh, by the afternoon. And then into tonight, we'll drop down to around 19 degrees wind chills in the teens. Tomorrow, upper 30s, still kind of breezy, so the wind chill is not going to improve a whole lot tomorrow as well. And as far as trick or treating goes for tonight, again, we will be much quieter and it will be a little breezy as well. Temperatures around 38 at 3 p.m., 5 p.m., 37, and then around 7 p.m., uh, 32 and of course for the times of trick-or-treating in your hometown you can head over to wqow.com for the latest on that 38 tomorrow 42 on thursday so a little better thursday mid 40s for the weekend with just small chances for a few showers maybe a little bit of snow mixing in at times as well and don't forget saturday night into sunday morning we fall back one hour